On January 1, 1995, a massive wave struck the Dropner gas platform in the North Sea. It rose over 25 meters, appeared without warning, and was captured by a laser sensor mounted on the rig. No storm, no seismic activity. The platform held, but the wave defied every known model. It was later classified as a rogue wave, the first ever confirmed by instruments in open ocean. In the years that followed, that same wave profile started to appear elsewhere, first in optics, then in plasma experiments, then in magnetic fields. It wasn't the environment that mattered, it was the shape. Short-lived spikes, steep, localized, unpredictable. The same mathematical structures used to describe Dropner, nonlinear wave equations, started matching observations across physics. Rogue waveforms have now been recreated in wave tanks, tracked in solar plasma, and simulated in artificial neural networks. The pattern keeps repeating even in systems with no physical connection, different forces, different materials, but the same sudden burst, and no one fully understands why.